And welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Age Origins. Let us be on our magical way. Also, my laptop charger died, so I gotta go buy a new one. I did go to Best Buy yesterday, but instead I defaulted and bought a... a uh, one of those Wi-Fi range extenders, so that way I can connect better to my desktop, which means these uploads won't take as long. Oh man, isn't that exciting? I know. You guys are totally creaming your pants right now. You, you may want to go clean up. It's kind of disgusting. Whoa, 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 Mr. Skeleton. Who do you think you are? Get away from me. I don't believe in that satanic language. How dare you try and attack me? Do you know who I am? Obviously, you do not, for you're dead. Alright, what do we have? I don't know what I just grabbed, but okay. Oh, yeah, this thing. Hey, guys. Look what I got. A device meant to hold a spirit, perhaps? Such would be my guess. Though, what might be left of any spirit within after such a long time trapped? It looks elven, all right. Considering that what I know of my ancestors, you could fit into a gem half that size, uh, that's all I could really tell you. <laughs> Is that blood in there? Whose, I wonder? You think it will be dried <coughs> up after so long? There must be magic involved. No shit, did you get that from Morgan? Let us touch the gem. Oh my, we got images in our head. Whoa, dude, who are you, bruh? It's an elf. Oh my, who is an arcane warrior, you say? I already know what all he says, so whatever. Come on, I'm not reading it. You can read it, I'm not doing it. Oh my. How did you come up in this gym? I guess he was uh, part of the original, you know, elves who was in that war against them humans or something. I don't know. We made them our slaves. Aren't we nice people in this game? Obviously. Come on. Give me your power. Ah, <laughs> oh, sure, I'll help him. Why not? Hmm. All right. Okay. 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 <clears throat> yes, I'll help you, bra. Approach the stone altar with the gem. Why not? Yeah, I require nothing for an act of mercy. I'm not really interested in the skills, though. All right. Let's see what happens. Skeletons attack us. Oh man. Alistair approves. That's right, Alistair. You approve of me doing a good deed. And Morgan didn't disapprove. It's a miracle, I know. What madness is this? Alright, come on. Enough, enough. I said enough. Die! I must continue on through these ruins. Tiss, tiss, tiss. I do not know why these skeletons try and attack. Oh, wait, well, where'd you come from? Get out of here. Hey, I said get out of here. That's what I thought. Now to read their corpses. Even though skeletons aren't really corpses, they're just skeletons, but either way. You useless ske- Okay, you have money on you. Good, good. Okay. <coughs> uh, which way shall I go down here, yo? And what is down here but something scary? Oh my. Two ways to go, you say? Well, skeletons are attacking me from this way, so I guess I'll go this way. Death to all the skeletons, because they dance around and try and make racist, obscene languages with their mouths. And it's not very nice, I know. I don't know why they do it, I guess because uh, pe other people have skin and they don't. So they're prejudicing against people with the color of the skin. And that means everybody. I know, aren't they crazy? Silly skeletons. Alright, let's see. What the hell? Ooh, let's take the vial and fight. Yay. Where are you at? There's a revenant. Yay, kill it. Kill it with fire. Or magic. Or slice him up. Or get knocked down. But he's not gonna throw me down on the ground and rape me. He's not allowed to. But he's but he can die. He can do that. And Alistair killed him, which is kind of sad. How would you feel if Alistair killed you? 
you know, you're in hell, you're like, who'd you get killed by? I get killed by Alistair. Ah, 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 ah. You'd be the laughing stock of hell. I know. That poor Revenant. And to add insult to injury, he was frozen. And I'll take that scrap of paper. For no reason. Why don't they ever drop anything good? Come on. There we go, some money. I require nothing more but the essentials. Okay, let's see. Nope. <sighs> damn you, damn you all to hell. Uh oh, the game is saving. I don't know how I feel about that. Oh my ah, fire! Ah! An arrow. Took an arrow to the shoulder. Ow. Oh. Die, you die. Somebody leveled up. It was Zevran. Oh my. Alright, come on, skeleton. Who are you? You're obviously a terrorist. Alright. I'm gonna try and complete this area today, by the way. So this may be slightly longer than I want it to be, but I will get done with this place one way or another. At least get through the stupid ruins, so that way I no longer have to worry about it. Combat movement... Hmm. I guess this will... Uh, yeah, okay, there we go. You can have the hands. Try to understand. He's a magic man, except he's not. He's an elf. What are you talking about? Hmm. Perhaps I could have a try at that. Oh, if you open it, then I'll be. Oh my God, he actually opened something. <laughs> How the hell? Where's this even leading me? Oh my God, a giant door. This can't be. No, doors don't exist in this universe. Oh my, let us see what's going on in here. Maybe there's something, oh my god. No, more skeletons. I know, what is this madness? That I was done fighting these stupid skeletons. Obviously not. Alright, come on. Ah, da -da 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 -da. Hit you with my shield, you fall down and die dramatically. Not really. Alright. I believe this is well we can do quite a few things. Oh no. What is that? <clears throat> oh no. It's an arcane horror. Great. Screw you, you stupid magic wielding piece of garbage. Ah Let me go. I'm oh whoa 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 whoa. What the hell? That's not cool, man. That's not cool at all. Nor are these skeletons wailing on me. Stop that. You just can't teleport. That's against the rules. No fair. No fair. Alright, come on. Oh, gee. No. <clears throat> this revenant is really annoying me. Or arcane horror, I should say. Get him, Zevran. Get him. And keep him there for a second. <clears throat> okay, he's dead. Good job, guys. Oh my god. Zevran's dead. Damn it, Zevran, we just won too. Did you really had to die? Doesn't help that I didn't give you any better armor, but whatever. We shall skip those details because I don't really like to have Zevran around with me. For obvious reasons, as you can probably tell. He can't really lockpick to save his goddamn life unless I, you know, upgrade that. Which I prefer Liliana around. Though Zevran is pretty funny, but oh well. I'm gonna try and show off every character. I'm gonna try and bring them along with me as much as possible. Like, I'll bring Shell along with me when we go to uh, Wasama. Wynn had her moment to shine in the tower, so who knows when I'll use her. Of course, my inventory's full. Why wouldn't it be? Kill the wabbit! Kill the wabbit! Destroy. Okay, now allow me to do a stick, you say. I require no stick. My doggy already loves me. Destroy it. Kill it with fire. Now, yes, just throw it on the ground and stomp on it. Because that'll totally work when you're trying to destroy the armor. 
Not bad. Not bad at all. That'd actually be something quite handy to give to Mr. Zevran Man. Of course it does have... F well, what are the requirements? Level 22 strength. God damn it, Zevran. <coughs> I swear. You are just one big disappointment. Perhaps I, could have a try I don't believe you, but go ahead. I knew it. You are useless to me. God damn you. God damn you, Zevran. Why are you so useless? The Emperor will not be pleased, and he is not as kind as I am. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, off we go. Well, we got this door to go through, which we will probably find something erotic. I'm hoping, anyway. Possibly not. Skeletons don't count as erotic. Though they have no boners. Though they are made of bones, I know. Alright, come on. And you're dead. <coughs> Sarcophagus, open. What is this? That is useless to me. Hmm. What's in there? Yeah, I'll take it. He's dead. <laughs> Wait a minute. Yay, this is the lair of the werewolves. We gotta go dive underwater. And I sunk to the bottom and drowned because my idiot character was wearing heavy armor and he couldn't swim. The end. That's how it should happen anyway. But this game doesn't believe in physics. <laughs> Either way. Ooh, I have gum on my desk. Very tempting, but I shall not chew it during a Let's Play. That would not be kind at all. And it would annoy the people and they'd say, Stop eating. Stop eating now or I'll leave a dirty comment about your mother. And then I'll say, I know. And then they'll go, what? Exactly. <coughs> oh wait, this is the part where we fight werewolves. Oh jeez. Nah, right, bring it on werewolves. My first time ever playing through this game, I actually died at this part because I got overwhelmed and they started mauling on me. <clears throat> that and I was still a noob and I was wearing all the wrong stuff. Wasn't even wearing the right type of armor or the, using the right type of weapons, so yeah. I, 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 I blame all those kitty Nintendo games for not preparing me for any of this stuff. Alright, let's see. Okay, let's see. No, no, no. They don't drop anything useful at all to me. I know there's more werewolves. There you are, I see you. But you just wait. I'll be up there in a second. Okay. I don't want that. That's useless. Up the stairs and look around. There's a werewolf and he's trying to go downtown. But everybody there, they're prejudiced and he's not allowed in because they said no dogs allowed. It's pretty sad. Hey, get away from me. No. Stop that. Stop it now. Stop trying to bite me. I will have you neutered. That's right. You're a bad dog. You're a bad, bad dog. You gotta be put down. Aw. Oh, let's give everybody some sad news. While I was at my grandmother's house with the family, they found one of the kitties who was a fat kitty who we found. Uh, a couple of years ago, I should say, or about three years or four years, I don't remember. But either way, we found the kitty dead. That poor kitty. And I just saw the kitty, too. It died. Apparently, a buzzard's been eating it or something. I'm not sure how it died. I th we think it was a hog or s a fox or something. I don't know. My kitty that I have had over here for years didn't die, though. But the fat kitty did die. It was an event. It was a kitty that we found who was starving one day and was all alone, and we kept it over there at my grandmother's house, and it got really, really fat, and now it's dead. It's pretty sad, cause it all, cause it would meow like crazy, and I was, and I even named it, and it was a fat kitty, and it was sad. I didn't see its dead body though, so I don't plan on it. Uh oh, werewolves. How's it going? We do not wish any more of our people hurt. Yeah, that's what I thought. I ask you this now, outsider. No. Are you willing to parlay? 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 I don't even know the meaning of the word parlay. Okay, I'll parlay with you. Not with me. I do know what parlay means. I have been sent to you on behalf of the lady. Oh she my. She you may not be aware of everything you should be. <coughs> she means you no harm. Provided your willingness to parlay in peace is an honest one. Obviously. I shall then. 
sure. Follow me. But I warn you, if you break your promise and harm her, I will come back from the Fade itself to see you pay. Okay, I'm not gonna... I'm not violent, what are you talking about? People attack me. Now take me to the sexy lady. Let me put on my nice dress shirt and some cologne and do an erotic smile at her. Alright, where is she? Whoa, whoa, werewolf, stop that. Can't creep up on me like that. Roar! Stop it. Werewolves used roar. <laughs> stop that. Oh my, look at them boobies. Oh my god, her hand. That's right, kneel before me, peasant. I bid you welcome, mortal. I am the lady of the forest. Hello, lady. Would you like to have my baby? Thank you, I'm glad. Do not that. listen to him, lady. He will betray you. Yes, I will. No. Bad. Lush, swift runner. That's right, you tell him. for battle has only seen the death of the very ones you've been trying to save. Is that, is that what you want? No, my lady. Anything but that. That's right. And the time has come to speak with this outsider. To set our rage aside. I apologize on Swift Runner's behalf. He struggles with his nature. Then get naked as we are. Truer words were never spoken. But few could claim the same as these creatures, that their very nature is a curse. I know. Them. Yep. No doubt you have questions, mortal. I already know them. There are things that Zathrian has not told you. Well, I already know. I've already played through this game, but what is not he told me? Tell me. Come on. It was Zathrian who created the curse that these creatures suffer. The same curse that Zathrian's own people now suffer. Oh my. Centuries ago, when the Dalish first came to this land, a tribe of humans lived close to this forest. Really? They sought to drive the Dalish. Nice away. ass. Zathrian was a young man then. He had a son and daughter he loved greatly. Oh really? And while out hunting, the human tribe captured them both. Uh oh. <sighs> the humans tortured the boy, killed him. Oh God! The girl they raped. Uh, whoa! Left for dead. The Dalish found her, but she learned later she was with child. Oh God! She killed herself. That's oh my! That's horrible! Jesus Christ! I'd be pissed if I was Zathrian too. Zathrian came <coughs> to this room, <coughs> summoned a terrible spirit, binding it to the body of a great wolf. Oh my! So with a fang came to me. Witherfang hunted the humans of the tribe. <coughs> Many were killed, but others were cursed by his blood, becoming twisted and savage creatures. Like you, I guess. Twisted and savage, just as Witherfang himself is. Hmm. They were driven into the forest. When the human tribe finally left for good, their cursed brethren remained. Uh -oh. and mindless animals. That sucks. Until I found you, my lady. Good. You gave me peace. Oh, really? I showed Swiftrunner that there was another side to his bestial nature. I soothed his rage and his humanity emerged. Good, And good. he brought others to me. Huh. So, why didn't they rejoin the humans? Seems like the best option. They are still cursed, mortal. The best <coughs> side of their nature cannot be denied, and this places them forever outside of the company of their people. We seek to end the curse. The crimes committed against Zathrian's children were grave, but they were committed centuries ago by those who were long dead. Yep. Word was sent to Zathrian every time the land ships passed this way, asking him to come, but he has always ignored us. That's because he's a... No longer be denied. Whoa, 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 let's not get violent. We spread the curse to his people, so he must end the curse to save them. Please, mortal. You must go to him. Bring him here. 
If he sees these creatures, hears their plight, surely he will agree to end the curse. Well, you know, fine, but uh... No, let's not persuade that. Tell him if he refuses, I will ensure that Witherfang is never found. He will never cure his clan. Outside of this chamber, the passage leading back to the surface has been opened for you. Return with Zathrian as soon as you can. I will. <laughs> I don't know how Zathrian's gonna feel about this. He's kind of, you know, shady, and I don't know how he'd feel about talking to werewolves. And these guys, you know, aren't, you know, cool-tempered, and that tree's gonna attack me eventually. I can tell just by looking at it. I gotta go pick up Zathrian. This is gonna be a long walk. Ugh. Or is it? Or is it? I'm asking you a question, viewer. Answer me now. I will screw you too. How dare you make a sly remark like that? I'm on to you. Alright, come on. Up we go, the stairs. Yo, will Zathrian be waiting for us? I just spoiled for it. <laughs> yeah, take that. You don't get to answer. Um, look who it is. Ah, and here you are already. Molesting dead bodies, I see. Somehow I thought I'd find you here. Aren't you the intuitive one? I am. There was no way to tell what would happen once you reached this ruin, so I decided to come myself. Hmm. We need just so. Well then. No, I didn't. You didn't. May I ask then why are you leaving the ruin? <coughs> Alright, you need to go talk there to the lady. No I knew you would find it, and I did not care to give you a history lesson about things that have no bearing on your purpose here. You lie. It seems the spirit convinced you to act on her behalf. Might I inquire what she wants? She wants to talk. Come on. Get your ass down there. You do understand that she actually is Witherfang? Yeah, I thought so. She is the powerful spirit of this ancient forest that I summoned long ago and bound in the body of the wolf. Her nature is that of the forest itself. Beautiful and terrible. Serene and savage, maiden and beast. She is the lady and Witherfang both. Two oh sides my. of a single being. The curse came first from her. Those she afflicted with it mirrored her own nature, becoming savage beast as well as human. That's crazy. Man, that's crazy. I find that difficult to believe. They attacked my clan, and they were the same savages then that they have ever been. They deserve to be wiped out and not defended. Stop having so much hate. We'll accompany you back to the ruin. Let us go and speak to the spirit, and I will force her into Witherfang's form. He may then be slain and the heart taken. Okay, I'm not doing this. Even so, they are still the same worthless creatures that their ancestors were. Oh, come on, They deserve man. nothing more than the misery they possess. This is not your battle, Grey Warden. Let us just take the heart and be done with it. Stop hating, yo. Come on. You were not there. You did not see what... What, what they did to my son, to my daughter, and so many others. You are. I heard, finished. but how can you know how we had to struggle to be safe? How could I have let their crimes go unanswered? <coughs> Dude, that's our ancestors. You know, it happened forever ago. Come on, man. I have sworn to protect my people, and I shall. I will not lift a finger to help the descendants of savages who deserved the curse they received. Tis, tis. I'm disappointed in you. And what if it is revenge they want, and not talk? Will you safeguard me from harm? Yes, I will, as long as you don't attack. I fail to see the purpose behind this, but... Very well. It has been many centuries now. Let us see what the spirit has to say. She says, Get on the ground, and let's pound. And Zathrian did it. And it was very ugly, and I didn't like it, so I cried. I know. Ah, water, 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 water. <clears throat> Thank you, loading screen. Give me a chance to drink. Alright, come on. Roar! Stop it. Stop screaming. So here you are, spirit. 
she is the Lady of the Forest. You will address her properly. You've taken a name, spirit? <laughs> and you've given names to your pets? These beasts who follow you? It was they who gave me a name, Zathrian. And the names they take are their own. Yeah, that's right. They follow me because I help them to find who they are. Who they are has not changed from whom their ancestors were. Oh, come Wild on. Wild savages. Worthless dogs. Their twisted shape only mirrors their monstrous hearts. He said dogs. You will not help us, lady. It is as I warned you. He is not here to talk. To talk. No, I am here to talk, though I see little point in it. We all know where this will lead. Your Possibly. Your it, as does mine. It does not have to be that way. There is room in your heart for compassion, Zathrian. Surely your retribution is spent. My retribution is eternal, spirit. As is my pain. No, this my. is justice, no more. No, it's not, it's vengeance. You're certain your pain is the only reason you will not end this curse. Have you told the mortal how it was created? Hmm. He said he summoned you a man into a wolf. And so he did. <laughs> <laughs> Witherfang and I are bound as one being, but such powerful magic could not be accomplished without Zathrian's own blood. What? Your people believe you have rediscovered the immortality of their ancestors, Zathrian, but that is not true. So long as the curse exists, so do you. Oh, wow. No, that is not how it is. Hmm, so he would die and ends the curse. Uh, but what about I revenge? Did it for Come my on. People. I did it for my son. You're for lying. My daughter. Liar. For them, for justice, I would do anything. Justice. The curse would not end with Zathrian's death. His life, however, relies on its existence. And I believe his death plays a part in its ending. Hmm. Then we kill him. We no, kill no. Him no. No. For all your powers of speech, you are beasts still. What would you gain from killing me? Only I know how the ritual ends, and I will never do it. Oh, what? <sighs> you see? We must kill them all! Kill them, yes! They turn on you as quickly. Do what you have come here to do, Grey Warden, or get out of my way. <sighs> I'm not gonna help you, I'm sorry. I Hmm, yeah, I'm not gonna help We're you. We're standing for what's right here, no matter what. Then you die with them. Uh-oh. All of you will suffer as you deserve. Oh, shit. She turned into Witherfang, oh my. <clears throat> Alistair approves yet again. Oh, man. I'm a tree! Fear me! Even though that kind of sounds like Swift Runner. All right. Zathrian, I knew that we were going to fight eventually. I mean, y you were totally dodging all my questions and being like, Ha, ah, I'm better than you, and I'm an elf, and my daughter was raped, and my son was killed, and I hate my life. And you're dead, wow. No, no more. I agree. I, I cannot, cannot defeat you. Finish it. Kill him now. Finish him. No, Swift Runner. We will not kill him. If there is no room in our hearts for mercy, how may we expect there to be room in his? Magic. I cannot do as you ask, spirit. I am too old to know mercy. All I see are the faces of my children, <coughs> my people. I, I cannot do it. Oh, but you can. Come on. Perhaps I have lived too long. You have. Die. This hatred in me is like an ancient, gnarled root. It has consumed my soul. What of you, spirit? You are bound to the curse just as I am. Do you not fear your end? You are my maker, Zathrian. You gave me form and consciousness where none existed. I have known pain and love. Hope and fear, all the joy that is life. Hmm. Yet of all things, I desire nothing more than an end. To die, I beg oh you, my. Maker, put an end to me. We beg you, show mercy. 
This is sad. Dun dun dun. You shame me, spirit. I am an old man, alive long past his time. Then you will do it. You will end the curse. Do it, Zethrian. Yes, I think it is time. Let us. Let us put an end to all. Oh. And then they all die. No, no. <clears throat> Smash. Oh, I'm dying. No. Goodbye. Oh. Whoa. The hell is up with that ring? <clears throat> they're human again, and they're fully clothed. Isn't this touching? Listen to the music. It's over. She's gone, and we're human. You are. I can scarcely believe it. Alright. So what are you gonna do now, Swiftrunner? We'll leave the forest, I suppose. Find other humans, see what's out there for us. It should be quite interesting, don't you think? Yep. Thank you. We will never forget you. Thank you. I'll see you guys never. Oh my god, I've been recording for so long. Okay, I'm done today. <laughs>